And Yuki, this is going to be quite the event already. Preparations, as you mentioned, well underway. Right behind me here on the Art Museum steps, you might be able to tell that is the stage being set right here. This is where the parade will end, and we're told the Eagles players will pass between two and three million of their fans on the way here to the Art Museum. Crews already at the Art Museum, setting the stage for the millions expected to pack Center City to celebrate the world champion Philadelphia Eagles. We've been getting calls all day from people that are really excited and want to be a part of this. Jim Corrado, the president of the Independence Visitor Center, says he's expecting at least 2 million people to attend, many taking public transit to get to the area. Transit is going to be under stress, but uh, hopefully SEPTA will do a great job as they usually do in managing it. And those who want to make sure to get a prime spot along the route already booking hotels. A lot of excitement, a lot of excitement. Scott Nasser, the managing director of Lowe's Philadelphia, says all 500 plus rooms, including those with views of the parade route, already booked. The rooms are going very quickly. So I will tell you, we're fortunate. We're totally sold out at this time. With some guests deciding to extend their vacations the minute the Eagles secured their historic win. Some of the people who were staying overnight, they went right to the front desk and started booking for Wednesday evening as well. All right, so if you're thinking about booking a hotel room for Wednesday night, the best advice is you better do it quickly right now. At last check, some 85% of all of the hotel rooms in Philadelphia for that evening are already booked. I'm live here along the Art Museum steps. Greg Argos, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. It is on, Greg. Thanks so much. You can see the Parade of Champions live right here on CBS 3 on Thursday. We will be there every step of the way as the team makes their way up Broad Street and to the Art Museum. It's Eyewitness News and the Eagles. The celebration continues. Don't miss it.